And now for something absolutely different. Some of you know me as a Kundalini yoga teacher. Many of you know me as a Kundalini yoga therapist. And did you know that I also teach laughter yoga? Imagine that. So laughter yoga is an opportunity to use laughter as a form of medicine, as a form of exercise, and to stimulate the function of laughter in order to get all those happy hormones going, oxytocin, serotonin. Um, these are the hormones that make us feel a little bit more connected to each other, that reduce inflammation and pain, and really allow us to face life with a little bit more lightheartedness. And so that's what we're gonna do today, okay? So as we are going through our experience, I ask you, invite you to keep a open mind, Keep a idea that you are in it to win it. And everything that happens is about seeing what your comfort zone is and where your discomfort zone is. And that's super important because when you know that, you can transcend them, right? Safely and with intention. Okay, so first let's start with putting our hand over our eyes. And your hand is close to the eyes. So take a look around and notice what you see. I know, trick question, not much. And then if you pull your, your hand away just a little bit more and you look around, you can see more. And then if you pull your hand out all the way, so it's arm's length away, and you look around, you can see a lot. And the idea here is about shifting perspective. When you shift perspective, you create some distance between you and the thing that you might be upset or worried or nervous about, we are able to see a lot more and approach things from different perspectives. And this is the same process that we can use in order to break cycles. So as soon as you see something in your life, it's hard to unsee it. In other words, you can't unsee it. So that's where we're gonna have a little bit of fun here. So I'm gonna invite you now to think about <clears throat> how do we shift perspective and how do we break cycles? You're right, we move our bodies. And so if you join me here and just starting to shake and bounce, if you're standing, that's even better. And that will give you range, full body range, which means you can move your legs, you can move your feet, you can move your knees and your hips. I'm gonna do it right here so you can hear me and kind of feel where I'm going with this practice, okay? So we're gonna shake and bounce. And now we're gonna take a deep inhale and shake and bounce and shake and bounce and exhale. Keep shaking, keep moving your body, hold the breath, keep shaking and let it go. Exhale, one more time, inhale, hold the breath and shake and shake and shake and shake and shake and shake and, shake. and let it go, exhale. Nice. Now we're going to keep on moving our bodies. And you can do this gently. If you're sitting in a chair, that's awesome. If you're on the couch, that's cool. If you're standing, amazing. Just do this any way that you feel free and light because movement shifts perspective. Okay, so here we go. We're going to add some sound now and see what your body wants to do with the sound. Okay, follow along with me. So let it go. Did you notice that your movement changed a little bit? Here's another one. <laughs> nice. Okay, so as you are warming up your body and you're moving, we're also moving our vocal cords and we're creating a fun little sounds. Here's the next one. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. What kind of movement does wow make you want to do? Wow. Wow. 
wow, 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 and fruit. Nice. All right, let's pat ourselves down. Really good exercise, you know, like very simple ways to engage the body into this perspective shifting. Okay. Because what we know to be true, we're just tapping the body. Tap, 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 tap. Good. Keep going. Keep going. Give me a round of applause. Thank you for laughing on my own with you, wherever you are in the world. Yay. And freeze. Fantastic. What we know to be true is that motion creates emotion. So as you're moving your body, you're also giving yourself a chance to let go of whatever you might be holding tightly to. This is the basis of yoga. This is the basis of somatic healing, all that stuff. Okay, so let's start some laughter, shall we? We'll start with some clapping. We're going to bring our hands together. And as you bring your hands together, notice palm to palm, finger to finger, best you can. And we start to here massage all the organs and glands in our body just by clapping because the fingers are connected to our nervous system our nervous system runs through all the organs and in glands in the body and as you do this you start to stimulate all that great so we're clapping awesome now a little bit more we're going to add a rhythm Good. Keep a smile on your face. Now we add a sound. Ho, ho, ha, ha, ha. 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 Ho, ho, ha, ha. Ho ho ha 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 awesome very good very good yay very good very good yay one more time very good very good Yay, amazing. And so if you started through that introduction with me, you might feel be feeling a little warmer right now, totally normal, might be feeling a little short of breath, totally normal. We are using, we're using movement and laughter as a form of exercise. And that's where it starts to pick up pace and become a lot more fun to engage with. All right, so here's the next idea is that we don't actually need a sense of humor to laugh. We don't. We just need to take those opportunities to laugh as often and as much as we possibly can. Okay, so we're going to start by tapping. And again, this is a choice to laugh. It's not nothing funny particularly is happening here. And you're kind of doing it on demand. So it can feel a little bit forced. And that's the key. Sometimes we got to make choices in our lives. we got to take action because that's the necessary step. Not because we like it, not because it's comfortable, but because that's what's required in order to get something completed. Okay. So we're passing here. We're thumping on the thymus gland, one of the major glands in the body. And we're going to add a little laughter. Ready? Like this. Ho, 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 ho. <laughs> Ho, ho, ha, ha, ha. There we go. Ho, ho, ha, ha, ha. Ho, ho, ha, ha, ha. Ho, ho, ha, ha, ha. And we're going to add a little more. Ho, ho, ho. Ha, ha, ha. 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 We'll try again. Ho, ho, ha, ha, ha. 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 Very good. Very good. Yay. 
Very good. Very good. Yay. And one more time. Very good. Very good. Yay. Awesome. When I first started laughter yoga, I thought I had a good sense of humor. I thought I was on the lighter side of things. And it turned out I needed a lot of support and a lot of help to allow myself to express and to feel joy and happiness. And so if you're finding this a little awkward, <laughs> join the club. And part of it is this exercise of, hmm, where are my boundaries? Am I willing to cultivate playfulness? And that's what we want to do here. Okay. So out there in the wide world of YouTube land, does anybody have a birthday who might be watching this? This little exercise is for you. So for anybody who's got a birthday coming, that's all of you, here is a little birthday wish for you. We're going to sing the happy birthday song, and we're going to do it with ho, ho, ha, ha, ha. Okay, it goes like this. And you join me. Take your or orchestra fingers, and let's begin. Ho, 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 ha, ha. Ho, 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 ha, ha. Ho, 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 ha, ha, ha. Ho, 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 ha, ha. <laughs> very good, very good, yay. Very good, very good, yay. All right, so most birthdays across the world, cross cultures, maybe have a little bit of a wish, kind of a wish for the year ahead. Okay, and so in North America, we take candles, we put it on a cake, and then we blow at the candles and that person gets to make a wish. So we're doing that here, but we're doing it with laughter yoga, okay? So imagine that these are your candles, just two, and take a deep inhale, and we're going to blow out the candles and we're going to laugh. Ready? This is a wish for your year. Make a wish and blow it out. <laughs> and two more, because, you know, we're not two. And... Inhale and exhale, let it go. <laughs> and one more time. And let it go, exhale. Very good, very good. Yay. Awesome. And on birthdays, we generally give a gift or we have a a thing or something that we craft and we make to for somebody who's celebrating the birthday just because we love them and we want to show them our appreciation and gratitude for being here on this planet and I feel the same about you so I'm going to send you I'm going to gift you the gift of laughter okay I present you with the gift of laughter and then we're all I'm going to present it to you and then we're all going to laugh we'll do this three times ready I present you with the gift of laughter ready Oh, <laughs> I present you with the gift of laughter. <laughs> and one more time, the gift of laughter. <laughs> and if that wasn't enough, we'll just give you a little air tickle. So tickling yourself now, this is called an air tickle and all over the body, a little, little bit of laughter. <laughs> <laughs> and freeze. <laughs> so. There, engaging in playfulness and a little bit of playfulness generally leads to a little bit more. And so as your air tickling, we can do a little bit more. We can send an air kiss, flying kiss. Ready? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and another one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and the last one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Small, little bit of laughter. <laughs> Medium. <laughs> And big. <laughs> so 
Somewhere on your body is a place where you like to laugh and it's called the laughter button. So take your very powerful finger and point at any part of your body where we're going to do a little bit of laughter, okay? So very powerful finger and here is my laughter button. <laughs> you choose your own, ready? <laughs> and bring your arms all the way up and we're going to sigh it out ready and let it go exhale one more time inhale and let it go exhale One more time, inhale, and let it go, exhale. I'm gonna take a quick sip of water. Amazing, maybe you need a little water too. I'm gonna to take a little more breath work right now. <coughs> and here, we're gonna play with an energy ball. And in this energy ball, imagine all of your laughter. So we're gonna get really small with the laughter. Maybe we'll compress it all the way and get silent. And then we're gonna have big laughter. But first we're gonna breathe, ready? Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, and exhale. And now a little bit of laughter. Ho ho ho. Ho ho ho. Ha Little evil there. <laughs> <laughs> bravo, bravo, bravissimo. <clears throat> bravo, bravo, bravissimo. Bravo, bravo, bravissimo. Here is a dandelion. <clears throat> so a little more breath work here. Dandelion in the in the spring, uh, it starts they start to grow. They're yellow, and then in the fall or late summer, these dandelions go from yellow to white little balls of fluff, and that's what carries the seeds. <clears throat> and so we're gonna blow those dandelions. As kids, we would make wishes on those dandelion seeds, and they would go scattering and there's a way of making sure that our wish was known by the universe. Spiritual stuff started early, ready? Inhale very deeply and we're gonna blow. Good, make a wish, inhale and blow. And one more time and exhale. Amazing. Ho, ho, ha, 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 ho, ho, ha, ha, ha. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Fun stuff. <clears throat> We're going to move back into a little bit of movement. So we've done some laughter. We've done some breathing. The laughter gets all the happy hormones going. <clears throat> the breath work adds fuel there so that the energy can be carried all over. And then you move. And now we transport all of those happy hormones everywhere we need to go. 
So I'm going to create a little sound here, <clears throat> and then you join me, and we're going to play freeze, unfreeze. Ready? So as you hear me sounding, you move your body. When it stops and I say freeze, you're going to just strike a pose. <laughs> Very good. Free strike a pose. <laughs> Very good. Very good. Yay. Very good, very good, yay. Very good, very good, yay. So you can see here, we don't need a sense of humor to laugh. And as we laugh, we bring up <clears throat> more stuff so that we can feel a little bit more, less numbing, more feeling. And we can even laugh when we don't feel happy. We can even cultivate playfulness and make decisions to laugh. We can do all those things like we do all other things in our life. We can make decisions to be a little bit more lighthearted, playful, and take things less seriously. Okay. So here's a little song for you. It goes like this. Every little cell in my body is happy. Every little cell in my body is well. Dance along. Every little cell in my body is happy. Every little cell in my body is well. We're going real high. Every little cell in my body is happy. Every little cell in my body is well. <laughs> We're going real low. Every little cell in my body is happy. Every little soul in my body is well and freeze. Very good. Awesome. Just give yourself a little shake now. Shake, shake, shake. Shake it, shake, shake. <clears throat> I think you did really great today. And, and so as we complete our practice, there's a few things I want to offer to you. And that is that we can say yes to all of this. Okay. So bring your hands over your heart space and gently close your eyes. And now that we've been laughing and clapping and breathing together for this amount of time, I want to offer you an opportunity to wind things down, to close things down. So yes, this is a laughter meditation. And we're going to use sound and breath and our intention to complete this experience. So with your hands over your heart space, middle of your chest, gently close your eyes or look downwards, whatever feels most comfortable for you in the space that you're in. Take a deep inhale. And as we exhale, start to hum. Mm -hmm. Inhale deeply. Mm. And one more time, inhale very deeply and hum. Mm. The humming starts to soothe our nervous system, allows us to integrate all of that laughter and the happy hormones that went rushing through our bodies and keeping your hands on your heart take a deep inhale good and think of one thing that you feel grateful for in your life one thing and exhale inhale very deeply hold the breath and send a blessing a prayer a thought to that one thing that you feel grateful for one thing. And exhale. Good. One more time. Take a deep inhale. And send this loving, peaceful, healing energy to any place in the world where there's conflict or suffering. 
and exhale. Inhale very deeply, send this loving, peaceful, healing energy to your friends, your family, anyone that you can think of right now who needs your love. And P.S., that's everybody. And exhale. And send this loving, peaceful, healing energy to yourself for being who you are, for showing up, for paying attention, for giving yourself a chance to be vulnerable in this practice. And exhale. Amazing. Taking this time to reflect on your body, how your body feels, what you're experienced in the practice, what you learned about laughter itself and about your relationship to laughter. All of that is super important. And so we're signing off now. Lots of love to you. My name is Salima, yoga therapist. Lots of good yoga stuff here on my channel. Take a look around. And if you like what's happening here, subscribe, follow, like, do all the things. Join me on Instagram. Share with a friend because that's really sharing is caring. Lots of love until next time.